The number of domestic violence cases are growing across the nation and right here in Central Florida. But now, as Watch 2's Michelle Meredith reports, one local community is taking extra steps to put a stop to the violence. In Apopka, survivors of domestic abuse are getting additional, much needed help. Apopka, Florida, according to police, it has the third highest rate of domestic violence in Orange County. Why? Partially because of its size. It's the second largest city in the county with a population of 44,000. And there are other factors. We see higher rates of domestic violence in the Hispanic population, also poverty and um, certain you know, low-income groups. As a result, Apopka has become proactive. October is Domestic Violence Awareness Month, and today's council meeting started with a special proclamation. Well, uh, thanks very much. The Apopka Police Department has retrained all of its officers, trained them to take better reports, which make better cases in court. And the officers took a trip to Harbor House. And see there are true victims out there that are staying at the Harbor House, and they just got to see what's happening. And I think they really, it, got, it touched them. I'm the victim advocate for Harbor House. And they added a special advocate who has an office inside the police department. They call it EVE, early victim engagement. When the 911 call comes in, Allison Suarez is on the case, doing what it takes to get the victim and the family out of a dangerous situation. Because you go from, oh, I didn't mean it. Oh, here's a bouquet. Let's go on vacation. What can I give you? You know, it's okay. I'll never do it again. Right. Now there's an Eve advocate at the Apopka Police Department, the Orlando Police Department, and the Orange County Sheriff's Office. Together, these three agencies represent 95% of the domestic violence calls in Orange County. In Orange County, Michelle Meredith, West 2 News.